everyone and welcome to my channel Isabel here and I'm so happy that today we can share some time together I want to start by welcoming aboard to all of my new subscribers thank you so very much for joining me here on my little crafty space I really hope that you find interesting adorable and of course inspiring everything that I share over here okay for today we're gonna be talking about uh, some fall crafts because you know we have fall around the corner, uh, the cool weather is coming, sweater weather, yay, I just love it. I love the colors and everything that comes with it. Okay, for today I have um, some ideas that I want to share with you and I'm going to start with these beautiful scarecrows and look at them. Aren't they just adorable? They are super easy to put together. Of course, I used dice and I also used my Cricut machine to create the face of the scarecrow, meaning the eyes, the nose, and also the mouth. Super cute and adorable. I have two layers for the eyes, one white and one black. Then I used orange for the nose and black for the mouth. I used chalk pastel for the cheeks and, of course, my uh, Posca pen for the freckles. And then this uh, hair is made using those... Um, like really thin strips of paper that you use for quilling okay so what i did is that i used this little machine let me show it to you i have no idea where i got this but i've had it here in my stash for a very long time so you put this strip of paper over here and then you turn 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 this and you get this texture as you see here on the on the hair so it looks super cute and adorable and uh, if I turn this this is a jar die and this is a huge die by diamond dies look at this sorry for the glare let me take it out of the package this is the die look at the size super cute and adorable so what I did is that I uh, die cut one piece in white that is the back then one with uh, craft cardstock and then I just use the top as the hat using some pattern paper but of course I had to add the um, bottom strip to give the hat the shape look at this so this is if you see this is the cap then I added this strip and uh, then I use some jute to create a beautiful bow and these uh, sunflowers come from Dollar Tree so nothing fancy or complicated, just adding those uh, details that you know that they make the difference as all the uh, distressing around the edges. And I think this one looks super cute and adorable. I created three because I have two different projects for uh, this. I want to create a banner for my front door, but I'm not sure if I'm just going to leave the um, scarecrows like this or if I'm going to uh, add something here uh, in between them. So as soon as this is done and uh, on my door, I'm going to post a picture on my Instagram. So if you follow me over there, you're going to be able to see what the finished product looks like. Okay, so this is my first share. Super cute and adorable. And of course, you know that I love memory decks cards, and so I created three of them, of course, Scarecrow uh, themed, and this is the first one, and look at this, I created the same Scarecrow, but this time I used a paper punch, and this is a stamping up paper punch, and this is the one, super cute and adorable, and I did it exactly the same thing white base craft cardstock for the face and then I just uh, punched out just the top to create the um, hat <clears throat> but this time if you see I hand drew the face super cute and adorable I used a tiny stamp that says autumn is in the air I don't have the stamp here with me but this is a tiny stamp that I received as a gift on a shop a very long time ago and then I use uh, again the same jute to create the bow. Super cute and adorable. And I just love, love, love this memory deck style because it's a set that brings three different layers. And this is by Studio Light Essentials. And this is the die that I used. Okay? Super cute. So this is my first uh, memory deck. 
and then I created another one and this is all made using my Cricut machine including this strip for the hat super cute look at this so adorable I use my Heidi swap punch to create the holes over here and this is so adorable if you see I'm using the same face for all of them because I really really love this scarecrow face and that is why so this is the second one and then the last one for this one I wanted to create a shaker and so the face of the scarecrow is the shaker I use some seed beads for the uh, shaking beads and look at this super cute of course I use my orange slices I just love them and I think this one looks super simple yet really really beautiful okay so for this tiny jar what I did is that I used a uh, jade blossom dye this is the dye that I used clear jar outline dyes okay super cute it brings all of these pieces all the ones that you see over here so I used the smallest cup for this one okay and so that is the jar and then for the base of the memory dex card I used this die set and I think this one is from ZF Party and I got this from Amazon super super cute and adorable and look at this here what I did is that if you see I hope that you get to see that the base has this uh, stitched line so what I did is that I uh, die cut one in white, one in craft cardstock, and then I use my scissors just to trim all the border to have an extra layer, and then I used uh, the second layer from the set. And uh, no foam tape, no nothing, just behind the green layer. Okay, super cute, and here it is. So these are my shirts for today ladies, I really hope that you get inspired and that you are already working for your autumn uh, crafts because I mean for me that is the best season of all, the colors, the smells, the baking and the sweater weather is just amazing. So remember to be checking out the hashtag Satmore makes not only here on YouTube but also on Instagram because you're going to be amazed with everything that everybody shares every week. But for today, that is all. And I'm so happy that I could share with you these beautiful scarecrows with you. And I will be back very, very soon. But in the meantime, please take care of yourselves. And remember to always have a huge smile. Okay, bye.